how to make a rigid body simulation in Blender like this one. First, we are not going to delete this cube. We can hide it here or press, press H and Shift A Mesh Plane. We are going to put a plane, it's going to be the floor S to scale it, make it bigger. And then we want a sphere rolling on the floor. Shift A Mesh, we can add a sphere, G, Z to move it up like this. We can S scale it, make it a little bit uh, smaller. And then we can go in the physics properties and put rigid body. Now the sphere is a rigid body. If I press play with a space bar, the sphere is falling. Now on the timeline here, I can go back at frame one. The floor, I can make it also a rigid body. Rigid body. I press play, the two are falling. So the floor, we can choose the type of the rigid body here. Type, we can put passive here. So now the floor is not going to fall. Only the sphere. Now we can make another object. Shift A, mesh plane. We can go on the side on the view X. G, put it here, R to rotate like this, S, X, like this. The sphere is going to fall on this and then roll and go on the floor. We can rotate it a little bit more like this. And we need to make this also a rigid body. If we press play, it's just going on the floor. So this one. We can put rigid body too, and we can put passive because we don't want it to fall on the floor. So when we press play now, this is happening. But the sphere is acting a little weird, not really rolling. So what we need to do, if we, pre if we press N, this little window is here, we can go on item, the scale is not at one. We need the scale at one. So what we can do is select the sphere, go in object, apply scale. Also, what we can do is to change the shape here in collision here, shape. We can go here and choose sphere. And then when we press play, it is way better. Now I'm going to add the little cube here. The floor, we can make it bigger, S, Y, like this. And the cube, we can make it here on the scene. We can go on the view Y like this, S to make it smaller. And then we can put it on the floor, G, X, a G, Z, like this, G, Y like this. So this is going to do this and here. The cube, it is a rigid body too. So we can put rigid body and we need to, to put active because the cube needs to move. If you press play right now, you see it is moving a little. So it's going to be good. Now we can get the cube and we can duplicate it. Shift D, Z, put it on top like this. And then Shift R to put more like this, a little less. For example, this is good. And then get everything. The camera we can hide, we can get everything and duplicate. We can G, X, here and then shift D to duplicate X to move on X axis like this shift R then I can put I can put more I can select everything G X to move it a little bit like this for example and then when I'm going to press play this is happening it is not falling because we scaled 
the cube, and you see the scale, not at one. So we need to put the scale at one. We can do A to select everything because also we scaled the floor, we scaled this. So A and then object apply scale. Or you can do command A apply scale. The sphere setting mass, it is one kilo. We need to put more because the sphere is too light and all of the cube are one kilo too. So we can put the cube lighter or put the sphere heavier so i'm going to put the sphere at 20 kilo and then it is way better everything is falling if you want to make your animation faster you can change the speed of the rigid body in scene scene properties rigid body world and then speed you can put at one 1.5 if you want to make it faster you want to put that uh, 0.2 like this if you want to learn the basics of blender i have a free course where i teach you how to model how to render how to add materials how to put textures how to do animations you have the link in the description see you in another video bye